Are we in the morning time out here? Community note board. You have a side quest. <laughs> Didn't think you'd still be hanging around. Well, since you clearly don't have anything better to do, think I could put you to work? The remainder of your bounty. I need it delivered to someone. I've already got a porter picked out, too. Look at that dog. This here's Salmon. Since he'll be the one making the drop, it's your job to get him there safe. Doesn't seem like too much of a hassle, but who exactly is this money for? My son. Haven't seen him in a spell. Not since he left town. And never looked back. This gills me washing my hands of him. He's a grown man. Can't be clinging to his mom's skirts. Or her pocketbook. The crow's nest. Boy got sick of living under this steel sky. And my thumb, I suppose. So he went into the mountains way east of here. Found some more like-minded idiots. Kinda sad, if I'm being honest. If you're gonna run away, at least go somewhere interesting. Don't half-ass it. I meant what I said. Can't afford to take care of this town and his shit. <laughs> I raised him best I could. Gave him every advantage. But he's gotta learn to stand on his own two feet. Besides, I've got someone else to take care of. This now. persona music. Don't I, Sam? The dog barked. Much obliged. Once you make it to the crow's nest, find Toby. He'll make sure you get the reward I promised. But if I find a single hair out of place on Sam, you won't live to enjoy it. You keep my boy safe. Salmon headed for the village and I'm blind! Jesus! Oh, that's so brutal! God damn, they gotta fix that lighting, dude. My eyes! Oh, you know what I should do? Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Well, the lighting here is completely different. Oh, where's the community board? Isn't it over here? Yeah. The Frogmaster. We got an eye on that earlier. The kids. Special delivery. Coming in. Isn't Priscilla just a brittle house? Cloud Red Aerith. Let's go with it. But I got to ass ass. Music's so good. So good. I'm gonna run out there. I just wanna, no kidding, run through this cave at a different time of day and just see what it looks like. I remembered the ass ass. You, you should be proud of me. Oh my god. The music changed. At least I think it does. Maybe not. Might be the same. So we're in like the morning time now. I'm very curious what it would look like. It's the same music, yeah. I didn't hear the start of it earlier. I'm curious what it would be like if we went back to um, the first region. Grassland. 
Okay. And what chapter are we on? Um, we're on chapter four. Salmon. Follow Slammon. Don't you worry. Any monster that wants to get you is gonna have to go through me. Let's go, Slammon. Hey, Cloud, remind me. <laughs> the How music. Were you when you left home? Fourteen. Wait, it was spring, so thirteen. Suppose that ain't too unusual for small town boys like you. What'd your mom have to say? Not much. You try to stop me. Like you said, nothing unusual about it. But. But. Two thousand kill. She offered me that to make a fresh start. <laughs> Guess moms are the same all over. I turned the money down though. Didn't need it since I was planning to enlist straight away. <laughs> But you still can't help setting your price at two grand. Sentimental, ain't you? Wow. Story stuff. Let's do this. Keep it up. Let me come on, team. Uh, who had our? It was red. It's on you. Damn it. Oh my god, it's the stamp song. I don't believe it. Dude, look at this place in the day. Oh my god. Jesus, this shit looks amazing. God, look at this game, dude. Game just keeps giving. I don't I don't get it. This is like the best escort quest ever. And you know why it's fun? Because the dog's in front of us. We're following the dog. The dog's escorting us. Instead of us escorting the dog. So it it's better. Zemzalet assessed. Um, Kappa Wire also assessed. Okay. Let's get him. The music. Dude, this is amazing. My God, how are all the, even the small BS, how is even the small BS so good? How's even the, the smallest of things so good? Okay, hear me out. What? You know how some parents stop their kids from leaving the nest, claiming it's too soon or they're not ready? Any excuse to keep them at home. What about it? Love the parents are like that, but I told myself I'd be different. I'd never keep my little girl from flying. I don't want to clip her wings. I want her to soar. <laughs> I hear you scoffing. You think I can't do it? You think I'll keep her all to myself? <laughs> oh, yeah. And that's what scares me. As much as I want to let her fly, I don't know if I'll be able to let go when the time comes. Maybe I'll panic, get in the way, hold it down. <laughs> to keep us safe. Oh, Marley. I wish you could be a baby girl forever. <laughs> oh, my God. This game's amazing, bro. Oh, my God, dude. This game's amazing, dude. <laughs> wow. 
I'm just blown away. It's so good. It's the cheesy side quest is so good. Don't overdo it. I'm coming. Let's try our new thing. Puppy took damage. Oh no! I didn't mean to. Damn, dude, this area looks completely different. Like, it, we're just at a completely different place now. Can't heal salmon. It's like straight up unrecognizable. Oh my god, is that a lot of them? Okay. Follow Salmon. It's crazy how even, like, the smallest things in the game don't feel lame. You know? Like, all the mini-games are goofy fun. All the side quests, like, do stuff. Expand characters, at least. Shit together. Marlene's barely out of diapers. You've got time. Right, right. I'm just getting worked up over nothing. Yeah, she won't be leaving me for a while. Then again. Hey! <laughs> we have a very appropriate Barrett emote for this. This is shockingly a very fun side quest. Uh oh, Salmon. I was about to say, all we need is a big monster. And there it is. And there it is. Dude, I was literally about to say it. I don't believe it. Deal with that. Petrified. My ATB is whack. Oh wait, who has ass ass? Um, would I give? Would I give a sex? Uh, is it on Aerith? I'll show you what I can do. Attacking the aura that shrouds it will produce tornadoes. The aura will weaken with each tornado spawn, and once it's vanished, the drake will become pressured. Attacking it from behind with will weaken the aura without creating tornadoes.
Hey man, chill. I can't see shit with these damn trees. God damn. You'll see. You've got this. You're going away. That's it. No scratch. Here. Ready. Let's go. The relationship with Red 13 has changed. Coming. Uh, who do I need to use more stuff on? I need to use two things with 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 red. Um. Come on. Come on. Hit me again! I dare you. Yes, you should, Captain. You're dead. I haven't seen this yet. Gotta step it up. Yeah, our intimidating aura. Salmon, okay. Salmon's fine. Salmon's fine. Those guys were crazy. Controller's dying again. Salmon, where are you going, dude? <laughs> Too much excitement for one day? Well, we made it here. Sam, what are you doing here? <laughs> Came all this way and you're still full of energy. Uh, the dogs don't look as well do rendered as the cats. You? We're Sam's bodyguards. Your mom hired us to keep him safe and to make sure her boy got his allowance. Keep it. I ain't taking her money. I can make ends meet on my own. Who are they, Dylan? Friends of yours? Claire, what are you doing out of bed? You know you need to stay off your feet. I know you came all this way, but I can't accept that. Just make sure Sam gets home safe for me. You really are your mother's kid. Got her stubbornness and everything. Have it your way. Uh, Why don't you hang on to it? This is a fortune. If you really don't want it, I'll take it off your hands. But as a parent, I'm sure you want to give your kid the best life you can. And in my experience, that don't come cheap. Think it over. That's true. We'll take it. Oh. Dilster was looking for you, dude. Toby. Sorry, got a little tied up. Hang on. Aren't these guys with Avalanche? That was like a drug Who dealer. Might run into you. Avalanche? Wait, you mean they're the ones who blew up those reactors? The superstars themselves. I just want to say it is such an honor to meet you. Actually, while you're here, think I could ask you for a favor? Seeing as Dylan's uh, situation seems to be taken care of? Yep, it's all good. Excellent. In that case, why don't we step into my office for a chat? Right this way.
Your relationship with Barrett has deepened. Damn straight it has. You think my mom knew about me and Claire and the baby? Oh dear. Oh dear. Rose against Shinra welcomes all those Man, who you believe Mid in freedom. are something else. When I saw you on the news, I was blown away. Well, look at this damn place. And here you are, lending me a hand. It's literally a dream come true. Huh. Well, look at this damn place. Is this your office? So, here's the situation. There's this big lighthouse down by the Cape. And someone calling themselves the Merc of Junon Ugh. has turned it into their hideout or something. Curie. Oh, are they an acquaintance of yours? Sort of. What are the chances? I don't know about you, but I think fate brought us together. Anyway, that place has got a killer view. We used to go up there all the time and just chill. But it's too dangerous with all the monsters around, and that Merc hasn't done a thing about him. So I was hoping you could do me a solid and convince that Merc to help us out. The lighthouse is up ahead, right on the Cape. Apparently, it used to guide ships back in the Republic days, but that was like forever ago. Anyway, it's super out of the way and crawling with monsters. Anyone who thinks customers will come calling is out of their mind. They've done many a good deed in Midgar and all throughout the grasslands. Allegedly, that is. And like, if they're so good at doing good, then why aren't they doing anything now? Yo, you're the best! You know, I just knew I could count on you. So, you gonna help or... Me? You can sniff out trouble. <laughs> I suppose that does make me the most suitable candidate. Oh, pro tip, <laughs> if you ever get the chance, you ought to swing by the hill, too. You might even catch a glimpse of the Great Condor if you're lucky. If you're into that kind of stuff. Great Condor, huh? Never in my wildest dreams did I think I'd end up becoming best buds with Avalanche. Best buds. I get that we're brand new to the CAS, but handing out flyers and posting signs is getting old quick. Well, better get used to it. Another town? Where's the best spot to put up a poster, you think? What the heck? La 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 Curious about this old clavier. I'm Dorian, representative of the Piano Outreach Association. The POA? It is my duty to support those who liberate music from the page and bring it to life with their performances. <laughs> Victor. <laughs> Obtain sheet music found at pianos across the world to add these scores to your repertoire. If you achieve an A rank in performance, speak with Dorian, he'll reward you. I hope you will aid me in my humble mission to spread the joy of the piano to every corner of it the begins. world. It begins. Would you care to share a performance with me? It begins. Oh my God. Yeah. Surrender to the music. We are vessels through which it may flow. The melody our guide. Become one with the piano and all will be effortless. All right, dog. I will. Dang, that's sound. Okay. Test your might on this piano. <laughs> Who would you like to play the piano? Red 13. Okay. Um, press select for the piece you want to perform. Yeah, I, I get it. On our way. All right. Here we go.
I did. I thought it was done. Oh God. video game dude this is this is a real ass video game let's go first try uh oh no there's a star oh god there's a star uh damn dude damn uh there's a star though what is that what is that I'm gonna talk to him first. To show that you're a prodigy. Perfect no misses, oh my god. There's no finer sound in all the world than the voice of a humble piano. Tell Dorian how you performed. HP up materia, okay. You will earn achieve or achieving an A rank on a song. Mellifluous melodies are all the more pleasing when played. That on minigame the is so much fun. Thank you for sharing such joy with the world. I hope you will enchant us with even more splendid performances in time. So here's the thing. Here's what I'm starting to like. Here's what I'm starting to really appreciate about this game. Um, in the same way Final Fantasy VII OG did, there's a reason why the game has like so many mini games and so much like weird variety throughout it. The reason FF7 OG does that is because of the theme of the game. Like they're they're trying to make it seem like the planet is worth saving. They're trying to make it feel like okay, so we're doing this, right? But it's not just for the planet, it's for all the people on it. And you meet those people throughout the entire game, you know? You meet them and you experience their experiences and you get to do all the stuff that they do with them, you know, as you go on your journey. So, that's 100% what they're doing here. 100%. This game has so much ridiculous charm with the people in its world because what is the theme of the game? We need to save this goddamn planet. If we save, if, if this, if this goes away, it's over. All this is over. So all it really is, is it just a giant expansion over the previous game, over like the old game. Just a giant expansion over that. This game is fucking magical, dude. This might be one of like the greatest goddamn RPGs of all time. Came out here just to see the famous Queen's Blood rocker. All right, twist my arm, why don't you? I'll give you the show of a lifetime. I'm good. Oof, savage. <laughs> so you're not a talent scout or a fan. Why didn't you say something? The name's Neil, and I'm gonna be the world's greatest QB playing guitarist. What do you say? Want to play against a future celebrity? Well, I, I can't. I can't believe how good this game is. I literally can't. Like, met met all the expectations of Final Fantasy VII and exceeded it. Neil Young? <laughs> What's your last name? Whoa, that is... terrible! When destroyed, lower the power of the allied and enemy. When destroy, we're destroying cards now. I get it. It's a it's a three, so it's a level one, but a three power. It's good. The downside is mega oof, but I see its value. 
But you can destroy cards? Hmm. <gasps> yeah, you play it on the back row, maybe? The Devil Rider. Um, did I really put this Arch Dragon in there? I guess I did. Uh... Lower the power of enemy cards on affected tiles by one. That is not good to start. Actually, very bad to start. But I'll let it rip. Um, Crystal Crab. Uh, oh, God, I thought Moo would be a good starter. Tis not. Uh, Levicron it is. Levicron's a good start. And I can play Moo right after this, right? Oh. I'm playing Moo right after this, and I'm playing Chocomog. Um, unless I can take all lanes. Which I might do. To be completely honest, I might do that. Yeah, I'm just gonna broad broad scale right here. Here we go, I got an idea. Uh, I'm playing Chocomog after this in the middle. Oh, you have a Cho- Oh, shit. Okay, okay. Alright, this just got real. This card's supposed to be rare, though. <laughs> Excuse me, game. This card is supposed to be rare. Um, yeah, dude, you better hope you have something weird on diagonal. Uh oh. Kiss my ass. You're just gonna let me win? Legit? You're just gonna... Let me win? Okay. Let me win. Good night. You're just gonna let me win. I got a strong deck, man. Ayama you, thanks for the 10 gift subs. Dude, I find myself absolutely, like, every time I play this game, it shows me something new and I just fall in love. I'm just like, can't God believe damn, it. Dude. The floor with me. Then again, I can count on one hand the times I've won. I might actually not be cut out for this. <laughs> Hear that? An upbeat melody's coming to me, clear as day. That's it. I could feel my spirits rise. Red's having a tough time. Red. Red. Dude, all the QB NPCs have so much personality. One day you'll be able to brag about playing a game with me. You'll see. You'll at least stick around to listen, right? My god, dude. I can't believe how good this shit is. Dates back to the old Republic. Man, if those walls could talk. Speaking of, didn't we send people out there to watch for bandits or something? Toby's team, yeah. Some Yahoo thought it'd be the perfect place to hang their hat. Well, I hope they don't trash the place. We'll make sure they don't. Preserving Republic sites is an important part of the job. It's not about to let Shinra scrub the world and its shame. Man. You just knock this thing around. You just kick this into the ocean.
What do I hear? Shop music? Oh my god, I hear Chadley. Oh, I turned the camera one little angle and Chadley's here looming down my face. Hi, Chadwick. Wow. Have you heard of golden plumes? There are a variety of chocobo feather noted for their especially unique luster and are used for both ornamental and medicinal purposes. You should pick up any you find, as certain shops might be willing to trade them for goods. This might be one of the games of all time. Yo, Rhett 13. Very good name. Thanks for the 10 gift subs, man. That's a very good name. This might be one of the games of all time. I don't know, man. It's really crazy to me. Oh, Soothing Breeze, let's go. Let's go. Oh my god, what the hell? Uh... That hurts. Let's do Radiant Ward. Interesting. You're up. Now. On. My God, Aerith, you absorbed it. Try to do cool stuff. Red, can you do some cool shit for me? is amazing, dude. Let's go. This game is amazing, dude. My god. It, it also, you know, outside of the world and all that kind of stuff that it has, it also doesn't help that, like, it also really helps that it's got arguably, like, one of the most fun combat systems in anything I've ever played. Some of the most fun combat in anything. It doesn't help. It does help. I'm having a tough time gathering words. It's so good. 
This data is incredible. Thank you for your contribution. I hope you won't mind my mentioning, but I've observed that world intel collection. I'm getting out of here, Chad. They're not going to deal I'm with this. Certain, however, a veteran mercenary like you would never abandon a task. Are you still talking to my ear? Busy, but I'd appreciate You're far away. Jeez. Man. 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 I just need to sit here for a sec, chat. I I need a I need a I need to go kiss my wife or something. Hold on a second. I'll be right back. <laughs> you just reached Junon. What is this game and how does it exist? Right? How? I don't get it. I don't get it. I don't. I can't believe it, dude. Can't believe it. So I went downstairs, right? And uh, I was talking to Ripley. She had toys everywhere. I was trying to I was trying to uh, to to show JJ, or at least describe to her what the piano mini game is like. So I have to go do it again. But as I was doing that, I almost tripped on one of Ripley's big toys. I almost like keeled over, like, sweetie, you have to clean up your toys. This is not okay. And she's like, no, daddy, look. And she grabbed my hand and then pulled me across the room to the front of the room where you enter from. And she walked through her toys by skipping and jumping to the spots that don't have toys. And she's like, see? So she's gotten to the bargaining phase where she's just like, hey, so no, it's actually fine. Look, it's okay. <laughs> see, you can make it through. I'm like, dude, that ain't working on me. Dad, this is a skill issue, please. All right, Jessica, I hope you're watching. Um, check this out. JJ has not seen this yet, chat. Can I go through here? I can. Well, that's nice. Dude, this town is cool. Every town is cool. This guy just keeps playing, doesn't he? This guy just keeps playing. God, I did it. I did it again. I went up the same stupid stairs. All right, chat. Here we go. This time we star rank this, or I guess S stands for star. Star rank. Let's go. I'm not messing up. When it changed the octaves, I didn't realize what it was doing. I thought I was missing. This isn't in the OG at all. This is brand new town. All right, let's rock and roll. Aerith looking in the background. All 
I missed one. Uh, is that good enough? A rank. Dang, bro, you really need to get? No kidding. Only greats. You can't get any goods. I have to know. All right, here's the thing. I gotta know. You need them all to be great. Here's the thing. I kind of want to try again just to see if I can get it. I want to see what the reward is. If there is a reward. I was 400 points away. I'm never playing the piano again! Sorry. I quit this stupid hobby. I'm out of here. I don't have the patience for this. <laughs> See you later, old man! Trips on the way out. <laughs> What is that conversation in the background? Oh my god. Get a job. <laughs> get a job. People need to get off their soapboxes. Dude, what is this place? We're entering back in the Junon region now. Dude, I love the geography of the Junon region. It's so sick. And this is just one little chunk over here. It's so cool. We found the weed hippie town. All the freshest kush this side of Sector 7.
They did not have to go this hard on every little NPC interaction. There isn't a single job here we can handle. I'm just so out of shape since moving to the nest. Um, when have you ever been in shape? This is actually another town. The Condor. Our beloved Condor has not graced the skies above Junon in quite some time. We worry for her welfare and wish to hire someone to prepare a culinary feast that she will find too tempting to resist. Those willing to provide assistance are invited to join us on Condor Hill. Um, when have you ever been in shape? Uh oh. We got some QB players in here. Poison! This poison has ruined our seas, destroyed their beauty, left them as barren as Corel's desert! And is Shinra gonna answer for this crime? No, not unless we make them. Not unless we hold them to account. Exactly! You said it! We're here for one reason and one reason only. To rid our waters of everything Shinra! So we pound the pavement, get the word out, make the people mad as we are! It's funny how much of, uh, when you're outside of Midgar now, you realize how anti-Shinra everything is. And people are just like, not, not with it. Every town that is not Midgar is like, this place sucks. Heck? Nobody see that there? The legend also tells of the gifts Phoenix bestowed on the kind angler. As thanks for his fire, the great bird brought forth myriad fish into the world. So when next you partake of the region's seafood, remember to praise <laughs> Oh, well, this is just right down here. That's nice. This is going to give us revive on Phoenix, I think, right? Yo, Akarixia, thank you. Or Kirxia, that's what it is. And uh, Xiao and Cherno Alpha, appreciate it, guys. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Okay. I'm a god. One of the things I've seen that is nothing I've seen you go through feels copy and paste. Obviously, these things are, right? Obviously, it's an open world game, so when you go, you, like, have an idea of what you're going to do in each zone, you know? Well done. You've located and analyzed all the crystals in the Junon region. Thanks to you, Phoenix's flames will no doubt be that much more radiant. Phoenix material level up. Cool. I mean, it's an open world game, so you, you know we're kind of getting used to the checklist of things we got to look for. We got to get the springs, we got to get the fights, we got to get the, uh, the summon stuff, right? Little things here and there. We got to get the new items that are in the area. At least it always is rewarding us with new stuff, you know? Rewards feel like they're worth doing, instead of just being a checklist. We're outside the uh, place now, right? Yeah. Anyway, I mean, it is what the game is. Like, they're, they were unapologetic that, like, hey, we're, we're making an open world game, because that's what you expect. You expect to visit the world of Midgar, the same world that you, you visited in 1997, but actually explore it this time. Instead of it just being a map. And here's the crazy part. 
one of the developers said this. Final Fantasy, I, it was actually in my box that they sent me with the little, like, influencer thing. Kitase said, Final Fantasy has not had a world map since FF9. If you're not counting, like, the FF11s and FF14s. Technical, like, world map. Because even FF15 did not either. It was, it was one chunk. It was chunks and then it would also have a big city and that's about it. So an overworld map just has not existed. And it's like, yeah, you're technically right. Holy crap. That's crazy. So it's the first Final Fantasy, you know, to have like a world map. And that's the crazy part is that that was a defining part of, of Final Fantasy games, you know? Like that was a, a huge thing with that. Like I remember in FF6 and stuff, wow, even FF6 has a world map. That's really cool. I actually have to journey between place to place. That's really cool. And here's what's also funny. FF15 was zone based. You know, you think FF15 counts, but you hit a loading zone and it's like, here's your next zone. There was loading in that game. No, X, Final Fantasy X was not that, dude. FF10 had a, 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 a map, like not like a traversable map, like literally point A, point B, and you choose point A to point B. Do you walk from point A to point B? No, you do not. It's like Final Fantasy Tactics, where I was wondering when I was playing Tactics, I was like, oh, is this how this is? And yeah, oh, Tactics and FF10 have very similar sort of like worlds. It's just a map. You look at a map and you point from A to B. I'm like, oh, okay. So this is continuous. Like the difference between this and the old games is that they were continuous. They, were, they weren't that explorable, but they at least had you, you know, going from point A to point B. So I don't know. FF, yeah, FF10 was like the first Final Fantasy game that was hallways. It was essentially structured hallways. They're stages. Yeah, that's a better way of describing it. Um, what else we got to do here? We got a ton of... We got the QB match. We got two QB matches we got to do. Let's do it. I mean, granted, I actually really dug that about FF10 when it comes out, when it, when it came out. I actually liked that about it. It felt like the game was just beelining us from big set piece to big set piece. It made it kind of fun. The linear part of the game sort of made it sort of, for, sort of enjoyable, you know? So I think there's space for that. It's just that you reach like an FF13 level of linearity. And for me, all the only reason I was playing FF13 was to get to the big map. That was it. Like, and I realized, oh, oh well, I don't want to... I actually don't want to keep playing anymore because now I have to keep going through this to eventually get to the big map. And once I get the big map done, I'm, I don't care anymore. Like I've lost interest. So I just kind of stopped playing 13. And 13 like feels like it begins when you get to the big map with all the, you know, just monsters and dinosaurs and the stuff that you get to fight. It's like, whoa, okay, cool. There you are. Yeah, it was called Grand Pulse. Yeah, that the big Grand Pulse map. I'm Cameron, Queen's Blood champion, and I roam the world in search of proper sport. Oh dear. I've scaled mountains, braved wastelands. As I communed with nature, I received a vision, the true spirit of this game we both play. And now I shall reveal it to you. Are you prepared? Okay. Then come. Um, yeah, sure, Cameron. Let's see what you got. Ooh, you have the Midgar Sormer. Damn. What else have we got? Um, we've gotten some new things, right? The Flame Trooper is very weird. When destroyed, lower the power of the allied and enemy cards affected on tiers by three. Here's the thing. I kind of want to rock that. I might rock that instead of a security officer. 
just because we can we can potentially begin the fight with the flame trooper and it's hella good right it's hella good but it's risky because you need to start the fight with it the zemzalet raise the power of allied cards on the affected tiles by three while this card is in play that's a one damage though friggin one damage um no i have some cards i still you know what to be real play it out because i have some cards that i haven't even had a chance to play yet like shiva he's a good starter but that's about it oh best starter we in we in business now boys oh please dear god don't do that play best starter let's go Um. Take that choke buff. Now oh, now you got me thinking about it, dude. That's weak. I would do Titan instead of that of that two fur. But this is this is too good. You need you need to occupy space. What am I doing? I want to play cards, but you need to occupy space in this. Es muy necesita. Yo, what? Uh, yeah, you, mother Pfeiffer. thinking here dang I'm not a fan of what I got oh it's necessario shut up I guess I'll just push this forward I don't like having a they I don't like the fact that he has two threes you destroyed your own card brother how could you? If I can play that one down there, then I can I can reclaim the middle. Okay, that's a weird card. Hate this. Hate this. Um. We play Chocobo over there. God, man, this is tough. Looking good for our heroes, boys. Uh-oh. We lost. For the first time in a while, we lost. There's really not much I can do. How could you? Maybe we'll get lucky. Maybe we'll get lucky. We're not getting lucky. No lucky. 
It lowered the power of my card all the way down, so we're screwed. Just kill me now, dude. Alright, dog. Alright. <sighs> give me give me that back. Give me that back. Same thing. Let it rock. Give me my Choco. Okay, no, Cactuar is a great starter. That's at plus three. Um... Damn, we got a three pull in the middle already. I like it. Okay. What does that do? Okay, I just occupied the top. Unless you have some weird... It was a little weird. Yeah, I'm gonna push this Chocomog forward. Or this Fat Chocobo forward. Let's do this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna play Fat Chocobo in the middle. See if I can just claim the middle. Well, that's a bummer. Uh-oh. I think I just locked you out. Dude. Destroyed. Absolutely destroyed. That's crazy you got destroyed that hard. That's crazy, man. Dude, Fat Chocobo for the win. Literally block the entire board. Wow. Yeah, dude, now that I think about it, the, the amount of, like, lane control that Fat Chocobo gets is huge. That's huge. When allied and enemy cards are destroyed, raise this card's power by one. <sighs> Damn, that's a buff card. What is happening? Oh God! What have I done? I have to tell them. They all need to know the terrible truth about Queen's blood. What? Okay. Were you granted a transcendent vision, as I too was? You look as though you've just seen a ghost. <laughs> Saying that, I'm reminded of the story of Lidrell Balmon, the creator of Queen's Blood. After he started selling cards, he spoke of hearing a strange voice. <laughs> he then withdrew from the public eye and became a recluse. <laughs> what? I saw him again until his death. 
There's no shortage of people who've had their lives turned upside down. I noticed. Cards. Just goes to show what a deep and captivating game it is. I noticed. Indeed, this match of ours stands as proof of that truth as well, I believe. Thank you for this experience, my friend. This game just keeps getting better and better, doesn't it? Just keeps getting better and better. Ooh, mithril ore is hella good. Kids! What are you doing here? We live here. No! Just doesn't stop. I find it crazy how much stuff there is to do in towns. I, I look forward to towns. Is that weird? In most games, I don't look forward to towns. I look forward to getting out of the town. I want to leave the town. I've seen this animation before. Yeah. The power of reused assets. There's a guy from Sector 7 Platefall that has this animation in Remake. <laughs> Hello? Who are you? My name's Michaela, and I'm a proud member of the CAS's Queen's Blood Promotion Committee. Our goal is to spread awareness about the game's diplomatic potential. We believe it's our best shot at getting Shinra to agree to negotiations with us. What do you say? Want to play and help me drum up interest? Hmm. We're almost there. Okay. Um, the Mind Flayer. That guy looks crazy. Uh, we got new cards. I got two security officers over here. And I'm thinking of something better. When played, add Mandragora minion to your hand. Actually a shockingly good uh, single card. Single play card. That's a weird one. Uh, the Midgar Stormer is what? When allied and enemy cards are destroyed, raise this card power by one. They're destroyed. Zemzalette seems too expensive. I'm getting rid of the Devil Rider. That You need a really specific deck for that. The Midgar Stormer seems very good. I'm rocking it. Shiva has not shown up yet. It isn't. Six power, I think, is the most damage I've seen so far. It's even bigger than the Fat Chocobo. Grenadier. When played, lower the power of enemy cards affected by four. Damn. Okay, this seems like it might be a lot of fun. I'm going to do this instead of one of the moves. I'm going to take out one of the moves for this crazy grenadier. That seems like it might be fun. I just want to use it. I want to see it do its thing. That sounds cool. No board control. It's, it's, it's all offense. Shiva starter. Here we go. Shiva's scary because uh, she's only one slot, right? Oh, you got those creepy guys from under the plate. Oh, this is an amazing card. Um, dude, I'm gonna put Shiva down there on that plus three. Let's go. You have a Tonberry King. Oh my god. You have a Tonberry King. I think about it a little bit. Yeah, Shiva's ranked two. Messed up my plan. Alright, dog.
I'm gonna play Shiva. I wanna see what it does. What in the... What is this card? This is an all or nothing? Yo, what? It's an all or... Whoa. This game is evolving. It's an end game card. It's it's a final play. I mean, I still like won. I still literally took every single lane. That's crazy, dude. It's a checkmate card. She covers every single spot you have. Wow. Okay, lower the power of allied and enemy cards on the afflicted. That is a lot of manipulation for a two slot. Or for a two pawn. This game that is so great. much fun. See what I'm talking about? That connection you feel when you're playing someone. You, my friend, are now officially a member of the Queen's Blood Promotion Committee. People laugh. Dude, this I game really is so this much game fun. Has oh my to god. Folks together in a way few things can. Because the key to world peace isn't violence. It's joy. Plain and simple joy. Comrade, I hereby ask you to go forth and play Queen's Blood. Spread the joy of gaming. I'm counting on you. Yeah, but your game's like haunted, lady. Your game gets into the hearts of people. It's haunted. That seems dangerous. Um, do we have an item shop around here? The vending machine. There's a Chadley. It's the notice board. I'm seeing if there's any place I can buy cards at. Spread the joy of gaming, Max. Do it now. Do it. Wow. Was the sky always this big? I said get a job. Well, that was a wonderful little town. I think we did everything, too. We kind of did. Man. Man. Where is this going? young lady. We've got a lovely breeze blowing today. You certainly do. So, what are you all looking at? We're on the lookout for the Great Condor. We try to catch sight of it every time it takes flight. Make sure it's in good health and all that. It's not really a danger to people, but its hunger can drive it to hunt larger prey. Let's just hope it never develops a taste for us. Surely you've seen our newsletter, haven't you? It's filled with fun facts about our beloved bird. I'm quite proud of it. Sir, I don't think the condor is going to show today. Maybe we should head back. No, let's wait a little longer, lad. That bird's got me a bit worried. Haven't seen it in a fair while now. I wonder if we should have given it something to eat after all. Perhaps. I put a post up on the notice board asking for help, but, uh... Well, if you're still looking for volunteers, we'd be more than happy to help. Well, far be it for me to turn down such an offer. It's a grand old bird. Makes its nest in a small How island pretty just this a is. stone's throw from here. You can save my life back when I was a lad, if you can believe it. The condor was looking out for me that day, so I thought I should start looking out for it. Keep tabs on its well-being and whatnot. 
Back during the war, I was running from some Shinra troopers when one of them got me in the back. I fell to the ground. I thought I was done for, until that bird snatched me up and flew me to the next town over. <laughs> I sometimes wonder if it mistook me for its supper. I never managed to regain the use of my legs, unfortunately. But I feel my spirit soar when I watch that condor fly. I may be stuck here, but at least they're still free. It's a proud creature, a hunter at heart. We've tried to feed it before, but it seems to prefer catching its own prey. If something smelled enticing enough, though, it might be moved to come and take a closer look, I suspect. Thank you. I appreciate it. One of the condor's favorite hunting spots is in the woods nearby. You'll need a chocobo that can manage the climb to get there. It's pretty tough. Probably a spot that I've already been to. <laughs> you know? Wow, dude. Dude, the Junon region is huge. That man was 30 years old. That's a good point. Is that a cow? Look, over there. It wants beef? Oh my god. It wants beef? There goes the condor's dinner. Maybe we can track its scent. But it was running so fast. Okay, we're gonna run around with our chicken, okay? I have to smell for stuff. Let's go this way. See that line? We have to follow it. You see where it is? Look at that. You see that? What is it? What is it? You see it? What is it? You don't know? What does it look like? Baby a baby chick. Very good. What color is it? White. It's a white baby chick. Very cute. This is, a place, is this a place? You don't know? We're just following this thing. You see it? We gotta go to where it goes. What's, what's that? What do you see? Oh no! I'm fighting those guys. Look at that! Oh no, I got the cow. We have to save the cow. The chocobo can track him. We have to save the cow. Big monster. Uh, smell? There it is. Okay, let's go. Ready? We have cow. We have to save the cow. It's this way. Yeah, the bad guy stole the cow, huh? Poor cow. You don't see him anywhere? Is it a scary cave? Let's smell some more. He's over here. And where do you go down? Ugh. Mommy's a little upset. Yeah. Can you just lean back on dad? Okay. It's okay. Mommy still loves you. She just doesn't want you to get sick, honey, okay? 
That's it. Was it a monster? What? Yeah. Let's go find it. Yeah, chat, we were here before. Where are the chickens? Our chickens are back there. We kept them there. There's the monster. You see it? Go. Learn about him. Let's read about him. Let's read about him. He's an airborne lizard that lives in caves. Mutated after consuming creatures exposed to Mako in the underwater reactor. As a result, its flesh has begun to rot. The creature still lives and breathes. It's weak to wind. Get ready. Ow. Get him. Okay, let's do this. Look at this. Why don't you leave Yeah, we're trying to save the cow. Ooh, I can do Soothing Breeze. Cool. Everybody just heals. It's on you. On it, Big fight. He's like, I want to play too. <laughs> you want to play too? Yeah. I'll teach you how to play these games, sweetie. Monster flesh or bovine meat? Oh no. Oh no, I think I have to choose the bovine meat. Uh. I guess so. Yeah. Okay. Oh, the cow's gone. Turned into beef. I don't think she knew that, chat. <laughs> Until now. <laughs> Turned into burgers and fries. Oh, you're Hello. back. Hope it wasn't too much trouble. You can put the food right over there. Thank you. Okay. Yeah. This is recommended this from the is old man. Quite the cut of meat. I've no doubt the bird will be unable to resist the call of such fine dining. I'm trying to get a bird. 
Wait for the birdie. Waiting Gotta for the bird. say, it's kind of nice looking up and seeing a blue sky. Beats a steel one, that's for sure. <laughs> Though at least with the steel sky, you know your limits. Out here, it's endless. I kind of get what Aerith was saying now. Yeah, maybe. Hey, look! Mm -hmm. oh. What a sight! I never that's dreamed I'd be bird. able to see That's a big bird. Like uh, oh, wait, we have to get a photograph. Grab the camera. Yes, sir! Come on! Wait, wait, wait. Gather around, everyone. That is a lot of me. Quickly! Quickly! Say cheese! Oh, I really hope one of those came out good. So, snap any good shots? I hope so. It just showed up. I could barely hold my camera and... Really? Couldn't tell from a shot like this. I want to see the picture. Ah. <laughs> well, I haven't looked this happy since I was a lad. A picture of the bird. moments like these that make condor watching so exhilarating. You never know what to expect. Well, wait, scouts, wait. let's finish writing up today's report and start preparing for our next fateful encounter. Sir! They're talking. And hopefully next time we'll be able to snap a clear picture of that bird. Sir! Miss? I'd like you to have this as a souvenir. Ooh, see the picture. Wow. <laughs> nice Warding materia. Well, that was a cool side quest. Uh, I blew it again, just like I always do. I really am nothing but a colossal failure. Want to run around? Okay, but run around with that. Wow. Wow, sweetie, you're running around. Move this to move the camera. Go that way. Can you go that way? Anyone over there? Point it that direction. <laughs> okay, you can move the camera by doing this, see? And if you want to press square, see that square button? Press it. Press it. Oh, wait, let's run over here. Want to run around on chicken? No. Run around on the chicken. Press the, press the circle button. Press it again. Circle, circle. You jumping? Did you make the chicken jump? Do you like it? Can't jump. He can't jump. Yeah, he's not a good jumper. Uh, you run around with this. See? Can you point? Go that way. Point that way. Can you point that way? Over there? Can you go over that way? Try to point. Watch out! Watch out! Oh god! There you go. Point that way. Not bad. Here, wanna run down? Here, run down. Just press that one. Just press that one. Now move it. Very good. You riding a chicken? Did that chicken jump? <laughs> This game's cool, huh? Okay. You want to go that way? I'll help you. I'll help you. There you go. You want to run? Here we go. Ready? We're gonna go fast. Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! Big jumps. Whoa! That's a big slide. All right. <laughs> Okay. All right. Do you have to go to bed? All right. Back to business. That dog escort quest with Barrett was amazing. It was made for me. Couldn't believe it. It's cool that we get to see, like, the Fort Condor Condor 
show up in some way. That's kind of neat. Whoa, whoa. He actually hangs out over there? Yo, what? That is so cool. That is so sick. And we got a bunch over here? A bunch with no chick? Huh. This game is friggin' magical. These deer out of here. More Zemzalets. Okay then. No Let's finish this. Deal with that. Cloud as ice. Nothing to it. I need to put some more shortcuts for red. I really do. <clears throat> okay. Let's actually do that right now. I really need to. Tyrion equipment. Combat settings, red 13. Um, what can be done in the air? Nothing? Dude, red is really stuck on the ground. Holy crap. He really is. Uh, sentinel stance. Wind current, crescent claw. Yeah, oh man. Guess so. So, warding materia is for compatible with poison, binding, time subversion, petrify, poison petrify. Cool. Grants resistance to the link materia's detrimental status effect. So, it's good for a few things. But, requiring a link slot is rough. But, 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 but. I think it'd be worth it here. Fire and ice to warding. Nice. No, I'm an idiot. That doesn't work with that. Doesn't work with that. I'm an idiot. It's not first stuff like that. Let's put wind back on. Duh. It's not elemental. 
only for... The thing is, I can't even cast that many things. It's pretty much just good for poison as of right now. Fact. Do I have anything on red that can make that work? No, I have nothing. Look at this place. Huh. Fort Condor portal confirmed. Now then, let us risk life and limb to discover the truth of this phenomenon. Yeah. Wait, no. What happened to the proto relic? Ain't that what we came for? Oh, yes, of course. <laughs> I seem to have gotten caught up in the excitement. <laughs> yeah, oh wait. Come on, let's get this over with before the boy wonder tries to talk us into worse. Boy wonder. Damn, we just made a Batman reference? A Batman reference in Final Fan. What the heck? Oh, that's where the Kyrie is. And it's like her house now. And it's got all this cute BS everywhere. Batman and Robin reference. For the bridge. Poor Condor looks so sick. Alright. Here we go, final four Condor fight. I forgot all about that, yeah. <laughs> I forgot all about that until I got over here. So many things have happened since then. All right, enter the, the hellscape that is Fort Condor. Now then, if I were a proto-relic, where would I be? Over here! Your princess and your treasure await you! Make haste, my hero! Oh my god. Mwah! 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 Uh, does he really think we don't realize it's him? If he does, then he's further gone than I thought. Friends, help us! The captain is in grave danger. And without him, we're doomed. All of us. What do you mean? We're nothing more than pieces in this game. Normally, we'd be stuck here, waiting on the board until someone came along to play with us. But all of that changed when the captain showed up. Ever since that day, we've been able to move around under our own power. I've never felt so alive. And it's all thanks to the captain. Without him, we're as good as dead. They're self-aware. <laughs> so how should we handle this? I don't think we can get the proto-relic back without the captain. Yeah, we gotta help him. <laughs> Cloud just does old poses he has from the, the old game. It's friggin' funny. Um, okay, Ballista was good. Cleric was good. I like team three. But they have three reds on their team. Meaning... Oh, wow, this is tough. They have more units than we do. Oh, God, this is gonna be hard. Um... So... Three reds... Beating, I need to run. Multiple blues. Uh, and actually, this is already the right team. It's rock and roll. Uh, Barrett, can I swap you out for Tifa? Let's do Barrett and Tifa. No, I need to do Cloud and Tifa. Let's just try that. Begin. Let's do this shit. Play it. You play it. That's a big boy. Oh my god. That's a big boy. Uh, put an elite in there. Oh my god.
Son of a bitch! The fight's green. Red. Damn, he just one-shotted my dude. This is crazy, man. Sixty seconds. No time to dawdle. the line please push the line oh my god you guys are going after the wrong targets here son of a mother They're going after the wrong targets, almost. Okay. Alright. I think we have the right setup for this. It feels okay. It does feel okay. But Tifa might not be the answer here. It might have to be Barret. Which is unfortunate because I wanted it to be... I want it to be Tifa. And I think it has to be Barret. So, we have to run blues. Thing's doing a great job over here, man. Legit doing a great job.
Uh oh. Cloud. I don't know how this ballista's still up, but this ballista's still up. Dang, man, I'm running out of units. Let's go. What is that, man? Twenty seconds, come on. Why would that guy go over there? Why? Why would that guy go over there? Why would that guy go over there? I don't get it. All right, we have a strategy. I can't believe that guy would go over there. He walked to the right instead of attacking the main tower. I'm pissed. Got timer scammed. I had to make decisions faster. Oh God. Why is this dog doing down here? This cheesy dog. Listen, just got murdered. In the elite. Leave this damn bird. That bird can have it. Minute left. This is balls. Was over there fighting for his life, man.
This is crazy. It's taking so long. Yeah, this one just takes too long. This is GG. Yeah, we gotta restart. Woo, man, damn, this one's tough. This one's really hard. I'm gonna go with this. Yeah, I'm gonna try the default one because you get two reds. Dude, you took out the cleric immediately. Oh my god. Can you kill that guy, man? Okay, we made a good decision here. Team Green, go! How are you able to shoot from that far? Dog. Dude, how am I not doing any damage to these guys? What the heck? Oh no, I, I messed it up. Green doesn't beat red. Blue beats red. My bad. That was my bad. I thought I had a I thought I had a winning combination over there. Okay, damn bro. God damn bro. Wow.
Maybe the right timing. I needed. Dude. Guys. Time to dawdle, come on. Let him have it. What is that, bro? What is that? Bunch of horse shit is what that is. That's crazy. So I'm guessing I have to save the, uh, I just have to save the clerics. Oh my god, you guys are so dumb! That's so stupid. That's so stupid that they go to the wrong one. Oh, that's so stupid. You idiot. You idiot, you go to the wrong one. Okay, saving the clerics to the very end. I have them, I have to. I gotta have to move the clerics to a certain way. Are you still alive? I believe you. Screw it. God, that's so stupid. It's crazy how the AI is now doing to me what we used to do to the AI. That's so crazy. Push it, push it, push it, push it.
the Rangers back. We can survive this. Make him focus on the target over here. Let's go! Strategy! Let's go! Strategy! Oh, my darling hero! Hey, hands off, Buttercup! You want to thank us so bad? Give us the proto relic. It's all about timing. That Barrett had to time him to hit it hard. I cannot do. What? This treasure is mine and mine alone. Never would I allow you knaves to claim it. Uh, Captain? Come, my loyal henchmen. With this, none can hope to stand against us. We shall build ourselves a sprawling empire. <laughs> hey, Captain, well, wait for us, Captain. Where are you going? We're back. We're back. That oligano piece of shit. <laughs> Talk about a dick move. <laughs> you hear what the cavalry said? This whole thing started when the captain showed up. Yeah, when they gained free will. They were pretty happy about that, weren't they? <laughs> that polygonal piece of shit. Indeed they were. I still remember the weight of the chains that bound me to Hojo's service. And the joy I felt when someone finally came along and set me free. It's no surprise he's become a symbol of hope. Even so, we can't just abandon those guys. Never mind the proto relic. Right. Speaking of which, I've reacquired its signal. <laughs> Send us the coordinates. Princess in another castle. There's another Fort Condor game? Oh my god. Are you kidding me? There's another one? There's four? There's another one. Holy crap. It's a me! Well, that was stupid fun. How, how they let the devs cook too much. You let the devs cook for like nearly 30 years. 25, dude. Chat, when you approach a, like a, a chocobo engagement area, your chocobo just shows up. You don't even need to call it. It just shows up because it's convenient. Dude. That's so cool. Pirate ship over there. That's so smart. I see you. I see you. We should be nervous around bridges, though. Damn, man. Look at this place. Damn, man. Look at this place. Tacky would be an understatement. Kyrie. Oh, I know. I think, uh, I think we actually get full health from the Condor fights. Shadow Yuck, thank you. Caster Troy, unlock life. Uh, Bucky Candreos, thanks for the gift sub. They certainly poured their energy into the promotional aspect. They'll be thrilled to hear it. Let's go. What in the hell is that? What have you done to this poor bird?
We've entered a party city. Log Moogle? And her theme song kicks in. Oh god. Did they turn Kyrie into a bird? Got Mega Potions now. Alpha Dunk Bangle is 800. Take it. Can't do the Manifestation of Planet's Blessing. I probably gotta craft some stuff before I pick up all this stuff, you know? Um, Planet's Blessing, I got 99 of these things, man. Can make ethers. Hmm. Crucible bracer. Uh, I'm still not finding any of this stuff. Crucible bracer, witch's armlet. Yo. Enhanced coral armlet. Let's go. Um. So to make all these, give me experience. Just making them. Okay. I actually dig the crafting system. It's kind of fun going back in and like reminding yourself, okay, I got to start making some potions. I had sage. Son of a bitch. I don't have sage. Nice house. Greetings. Kyrie, Merc of Junon. And you are? Oh man. I'm sure I got all excited thinking I had a customer. Well, thanks for making the trip out here to say hi, fellow Merc. Not your fellow anything. And quit calling yourself a merc. You're giving the real ones a bad name. Uh, what even is a merc? Nobody really knows. And besides, arguably this whole mess can be laid at your feet, mister. <sighs> I came all the way out to Junon to strike it rich, but nobody knows we're here. Or even that we exist. Zero publicity, which means zero clients. I mean, this is business 101. <sighs> Since you suck so bad at self-promotion, I had to pick up the slack and come up with an ad campaign. But, like... What's your brand? Tall, blonde, and not interested? Like <laughs> Face. To bankruptcy to me. <laughs> <clears throat> Allergies. What? Shut up. This thing can talk? Indeed. <laughs> Aren't you just the most adorable boy? Hey, you know, I've always wanted a pet of my own. Come here, come to mama. <laughs> uh, yikes. Okay, scratch that. Right. Anyway, as I was saying, I'm putting in all this work for us, yet we haven't managed to bring in a single customer. And if we don't get one really soon, your CEO and PR head is as good as done! But not to worry! I put my creative skills to work and came up with this ditty. Pretty good, right? Folks will be lining up in no time! 
Monsters? Well, what could have drawn them here? I'm sure your aggressive advertising has nothing to do with it. Please, Cloud, you've got to help me. After all, nobody knows how to take down monsters like a merc. So hire yourself. You're a pro, aren't you? Come on, don't be petty. Oh, I'll even give you some of these. Pass. Wait, our lives are in as much danger as hers now. We have to fight. Do we? But do we? You're ready for the battle theme version of this song, chat. Take the lead. You got this. Ready when you are. I saw you take that hit, you know. Take over. Taking over. What? You're dead. You're mine. Go on. It's on you. I'm coming. Looking for me? You can do it. Fred, what are you doing? What are you doing over here? together i got this first no big deal. okay no more playing nice oh there's weird chickens out here now this one's for you this is cool It's your turn. Get him. It's over. With me. Find the script. I'll make it quick. Now. No way. I'm in so much fun. I'm having so much fun! God! What in the holy sweet... Dumb hell is that? He's trying to eat me. Take it he ate me. So oh God. Follow me. What do you do? What are you? 
You absorb fire. Oh, that's good. Hitting them with elemental damage will pressure them, but also cause them to develop a resistance and begin absorbing the element. Once they gather enough energy, they unleash it. Oh, shit. Well, that was a gauntlet. Now I know why I wasn't getting any customers. Nobody could get past all those uglies. That was a gauntlet. I'm glad you learned something. Oh well. Guess I'll just have to close up shop and clear out. Anyway, I'm gonna split, but I'm sure you can take it from here. Catch you later, fellow Mer. Hey. Kyrie Chocobo gear. Wanna leave with Mama? Come on, you know you do. Okay, later. I wouldn't wish her on my worst enemy. <laughs> you and me both. <laughs> my dudes! I saw the monsters headed your way. I couldn't help but worry. But it looks like I worried for nothing. I should have known Avalanche could hold their own. <laughs> my dudes. Out of curiosity? What happened to that Merc? She moved on. Bummer. Well, guess we should get this place cleaned up. Oh yeah, Rhonda was telling me you do Merc work on the side too. For real? I can't believe you didn't say anything. Best buds don't keep secrets, you know. But I hope you'll lend me a hand the next time I need help. This dude's cho- this dude, what is your chocobo? Bro, what is your- what is your chicken? Bro. Chicken Riz? Huh. Wow. Avalanche by day, traveling marks by night. I don't know how you dudes find the time to do it all. Huh. Chicken Riz. Choco drip. Huh. That was Kyrie's chocobo gear. It was hers. The one we saw on the way in here. I'll put it on. I'll put it on. My chicken. Well, that was actually a fun mission, right? Was actually a fun mission. Okay. I don't know if there's much to do. Oh, dang. Okay, hold on a second. There's a scenic spot out here. I gotta find. A, I gotta find my way to. I don't even know where the heck I gotta go. We gotta figure out what the heck this thing is. And there's a spring around here. What? Straight down? It just keeps going. I heard you, but where the heck? It's gotta be over here, yeah. Getting all these this time. Thank 
fair cape. Damn, I've almost completed all of Junon. Cloud. Your combat data has revealed the location of the mind flare lurking in the Junon region. Mind flare. It said this eldritch horror devours the brains of its victims. We cannot turn a blind eye to this threat. Okay. Damn. It has its own island. Huh. Huh. D&D? Dude, look at this game, man. Look at it. This is not a Square Enix game, chat. Gotta understand that. This is not a, a single player Square Enix game. It is not. Square Enix doesn't make games like this. They don't. Not anymore. It's been like 20 plus years. This is a Squaresoft game. <laughs> wow, that's a good way of saying it. This is a Squaresoft game. Oh my god, this ship is making me sick. I'm gonna throw up. Oh my god, I'm gonna throw up. Ugh. Huh. Beach. Back to mainland. Okay. Well, we better get this thing at the end of this boat. Are those stairs accessible? Yeah. I'm gonna throw up. It's actually hurting my eyes. I feel like my head is doing this. Well, I'm certainly feeling the adventure aspect of this game. You really feel like you're going on a big adventure. Cloud's covering that thing. That's good. Cloud's just got a DSLR sitting in his pocket. Dude, look at these cliffs and shit. I gotta go climb up all that stuff? Let's go. Chicken. Wonder how much of this water is traversable. Right? Let's see how far they'll let me go. I'm gonna swim to Wutai. Probably not so much. It's further out than I thought we could go. Dang. Cool. Cool. 
Yeah, we don't need we don't need any advice RNG grinder. What the hell? There's more camps. No, we don't have any new weapons for Cloud. Not yet. No way there's a weapon for Cloud in here. No. Okay. That would have been wild. Huh? The hell? Dude. What? There's pirate treasure out here? Oh, this is definitely for something. Ruined treasury. There's like an entire pirate treasure out here. Okay. Could have used some better rewards for finding the goddamn pirate treasure. I will say. Slightly better rewards would have been nice. Uh, I, think, I think that's it for out here. Oh no, god, I almost didn't even see the whole ass chocobo wall. I almost teleported out of here. This game is so much fun, dude. Holy hell. This game is so much fun. up with these guys. What? Wait, you telling me that's not the spot? It's not. <laughs> Got an antidote and a grenade in there. They go together. I haven't used a grenade yet. We should probably try to use one in the next fight. We up here. That's for sure. Guess I got up. Damn, this Deal game is that. friggin' sick. This game is sick. Having Cloud be aerial combat, man, is mad cool. Oh yeah, roaches in Junon. I forgot. I got distracted. Oh no. You're done. Man. Well, that takes care of that. Look at the way he died, all sexy-like. Putting his hand behind his head. We can keep going up from here? Really? Really? Draw me like one of your French girls. I'm like one of your French owls. Uh, how does this place just keep going? Holy crap. 
How does it keep going? Okay. Oh, uh, there's really nothing up here. Right? There's actually nothing up here. Just a spot. I'm not missing any walls or anything, am I? This is probably for a side quest later. That's funny, you can see the Mog House all the way from here. Wait for a side quest later. tower, right? Yes. Yes, I did. There's some sort of fight going on over here. Let's do the Mind Flayer since we're uh, right here. Actually, am I not close to the bottom? I am not. Big old pirate ship. Already did that. Okay. All right, we're back. This absolutely massive area, dude. Chocobo and Quay, not like a baby Chocobo, right? Beware, Cloud. You've entered the Mind Flayer's natural habitat. There's still much we don't know about this creature, so make sure you are well prepared before proceeding. Yeah, huh? Oh no, it's a boss fight. What the hell did I just do? This is actually a boss. This is the area boss. Oh no, I didn't realize. I need a bunch. I need a banch. Banch me. Yeah. Um. It's the Questicodal of this area. Yeah. Once you get enough area intel, you can fight a mega boss for that area. Hope Kitase is serious about this Chrono Trigger remake. I mean, if he's talking about Chrono Trigger, that would be very surprising. And, uh... If they've gotten the if they've gotten the okay from Akira Toriyama, that is the craziest part. That's the hardest part. Is the the company that owns Akira Toriyama's intellectual property is apparently a bitch. Okay, mind flayer time. Let's give this a shot. It's not that Toriyama doesn't budge, it's that, like, the, the folks that essentially run his IP and what they own, they're very protective. I don't know if it's Toei, um, that owns, like, a piece of Chrono Trigger, I don't know. But, yeah, they're, they're not easy to work with, apparently. Could be Shueisha, I don't know. It's one of the, from what I've heard over the years, is one of the reasons why Chrono Trigger doesn't go anything past, like, just the old games and re-releases of the old games. Alright, here we go. Mind Flayer time. I'm happy with this party. We can go with this. Creepy squid monster. Holy hell. If it's a fight you want... Deal with that. I'll take care of them. That'll do. 
You better. Let's take a look at this. Uh, no weaknesses. Lesser resistances to that. It's immune to that. It can be poisoned, though. Can be slowed. All right. What do you mean? You'll see. Okay, so I wanted to get this with Aerith first. Get a uh, Radiant Ward up. Time. I can do this. Yeah. I don't like it. I'm not a fan. Go for it. Let's do this. Eldritch Horror? Oh my god, ow. Siphon thing, please. Let's do it. My God. Amazing. This game makes you feel so good when you do cool shit. Oh my god. Cloud, congratulations on dispatching the Mind Flare. I was concerned the fiend might feast upon your brains, but I'm glad to see my fears were unfounded. Only a true hero could ever have defeated such a malevolent evil. Your valiant efforts today have brought the world one step closer to peace. Uh -huh. Thank you, hero. Uh-huh. Thank you. Thank you. Party XP moving. Damn, bruh. Missing only two more things in Junon now. Here's the th here's the crazy part. 
I did not even... Oh, that's the frog quest. I did not even intend to do all this stuff. I really didn't. I just, I just kept going from one thing to the next, and the next thing you know, I was planning on saving this for later, and oh my god, I've done everything. How the hell have I done everything? How the hell have I been playing this game for seven hours already? How have I been playing this game for seven hours? I feel like it's been three. Oh my god, dude. All right. Uh, let's go to Condor Hill and figure out how we get up here. <sighs> it was Salmon, yes. I followed the dog. And he led me down this dark path. Of, you know, discovery. How much playtime I'm at? I am at... 24 hours and we haven't even crossed the ocean yet to go east here's the thing here's what's crazy here's just how nuts this is i'm just gonna throw it out i'm 24 hours into this piece i'm not even i didn't even not even my intention to do 100 percent run i'm 24 hours into this i am once we cross east that's, there's a boat thing, there's a boat mission, right? And then there's Costa del Sol. There's the trek from Costa del Sol to Corel. There's Corel. There's Corel to Golden Saucer. There's the first trip through the Golden Saucer. And then there's the... The prison, there's Corel Prison. I'm just throwing out the events of the old game. Don't say anything. There is, after that... Gongaga, Cosmo Canyon, Nibelheim, Rocket Town. Like, there's so much stuff. There's so... And that's just, like, the beginning. There's, there's so many more places and towns and things in my head that should be there in this... in this remake, right? That should be around. So, again, don't say anything. But my god, dude. Like, we're still at the beginning. This is still the beginning. If they really said, like, 100 to 150 hours, if you're looking to do everything, they might not have been actually... That might not have been just a big number that they're throwing around. They might not have been th just saying that shit. I'm like, okay, yeah. 100 hours, all right. You want a triple digit hour game? Yeah, okay, sure. Two discs? Yeah, okay, sure. We're gonna reclaim these waters and make them beautiful again. Claire's really lucky. Talk about a love story for the ages. Okay, I gotta try to find where this thing is. That's your crazy chicken. It is. We're building a new republic. Don't know what that means. Violence isn't the answer. <laughs> We're building a new republic. I don't know what that means, but it's happening. <laughs> I don't know what that means, but it's happening. Um. Oh. Oh, I found it. There's like a road that goes over here. Yeah, let's go rest. Yeah, was felt like two discs was maybe a nostalgia flex, just like a marketing move. It legit might not have been. I'm almost like they. Uh, I wasn't thinking that they were going to be able to keep up the quality of the grasslands. Where I was like, okay, so the grasslands was really good. I don't think the rest of the game is going to be up to the same quality. The next zones are going to be smaller or, you know, something. That's legit what I thought. Ugh. I don't like the look of this. Rare fleetwing variant identified. 
Commencing guidance protocol. Flea wings are also known as stalkers of the skies. When hunting, they descend so rapidly that their unsuspecting prey has no time to react, let alone fight back. To that end, barbecuing within their territory is not advisable, unless you want your food to vanish before your very eyes. As it happens, fleet wings are so perfectly adapted to life in the skies that their anatomy has inspired several aeronautical designs. Continued research into this aerodynamic wonder will surely pave the way for humanity's flight-filled future. You'll be soaring through the clouds before you know it. Thank you, Mai. Wow! Bring what it. a fight! <laughs> Okay. I'm coming. Got it. Yeah. Get him. Stop it. Twisters. Okay, let's see what the heck you guys do. Cut. Um wait, this is Vind. That's good because I Vind Vind very good. Ow, smack me in the goddamn head. shot. I have to do my projectile counter. Come on, man. Do a compression shot again. I believe in you. Want to try counter fire? Dang it! Stupid bastard! There was a time limit? Let's go! I freaking got it, bro! Okay, I got it. I, want, I really wanted to get the projectile counter. Okay, so the time limit is a problem. We got Final Fantasy 16 Heat Wave. Try to get this, uh... uh... Run it again, homie. Will you give me my health back, is the question. Ooh. <laughs> no. It does not. What is happening? Don't overdo it. It's your turn. 
Son of a bitch. Cloud is the best at doing this. Deal with that. It's funny that Cloud is the best one at doing this. He's Mr. Air Combat now. So dope. Cloud literally can stay in the air the whole time. It's so it's so cool. Yeah, Braver in the air is amazing, dude. God, man. God. Isn't Tifa good too? Tifa's okay in the air. So to, the, only, the only character that can go from ground to air is Cloud. By default, Tifa needs Cloud's help to get from ground to air, or synergy skills to get from ground to air. But as soon as she does, she's really good in the air. Um... The last mission. Right? Regional data accumulated. Wonder what is left. Actually accumulate. Well, is it the last the last Fort Condor? Looks like it. The last Fort Condor? Damn, that fast travel is crazy. Dang, dude, sometimes the lighting on these environments looks incredible, and sometimes it looks balls. But right now, holy mother of God. <laughs> dude, this is so nuts looking. It's so, cr it's so big. Then you get blinded, and you're like, ah, where'd the lighting go? What happened? All right, where do I gotta go? This is like... Yeah, Tifa gets a natural launcher with, uh, with Gale. I hope this is up here. Yeah, the performance is a little bit jank because it almost feels like the game is too ambitious. Uh... Dude, how do I get to this area? Yo, Habij, thank you, and Mr. Smiley, appreciate it, man. Long-time watcher streams helped me immensely during COVID times, introduced me to my favorite game uh, with FF7. Brought me closer to fighting games as well, keeping awesome. PS Rebirth is unbelievably good. Yeah, dude. I mean... Yeah. Uh, yeah. I gotta figure out how to get over here. How do I get over here? Gotta climb up river or something? Sheesh. Maybe up and over there? I don't know. Maybe around? Where do you want me to go, game? Mm -hmm. 
This ain't it. Unless we got a, a face to climb. Nope. This is not it. But that could be... No. Damn it. Bobby. What I can do? Go here. And probably go down. Right? Let's just follow this in the opposite direction. Right. Oh god. Big all fights. Um dog, no. I actually have to do some like searching. I legit gotta go looking for this thing. There's so much verticality on this level that it's hard to find this. I really don't know. Is this where I was at before? No, it's not. Jesus, man. back. Holy hell. It's fun not knowing. Right? It's kind of cool that, like, we're trying to explore this environment and look for this thing, and we have to figure out how to get there. It's kind of cool. Maybe that is it. Yo, hold up, hold up, hold up. Damn, lighting looks great here. Dude, my PS5 must be so tired. I'm surprised it's still going. You ran a lot around looking a lot for it too. Yeah, it's kind of kind of interesting that it's not just obvious. It's on the other side, but there's a there's a bridge. So this has to be it. Hurry up, Chocobo, my PS5 is melting. Dark Oroxis, thank you. Yeah. All right. All right. Then we go down from here. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah. Camps in a place like this. Only people with black chocobos. My god, please don't, you suicidal chicken. I gotta launch PS5. Oh, it's in this camp. Yeah. We were here wondering if this would lead to something. Preparations complete and standing by. You may proceed when ready, Cloud. We head back in there. It'll mean going up against the captain one more time. Fine by me. Let's rip him a new one. Oh, goody. The last one, you know, was so easy. Jeez, man. The last one was so easy. Enter the world of Fort Condor. Yeah, why not? Yeah, why not, brother? This is probably going to be mad hard. Or we just get hella lucky first try? Is this the captain's empire? Many moons have passed. Far too many to recall since my search began. Yet my treasure still eludes. Not I've gleaned, but loneliness. What are you doing? Stay back! We won't let anyone harm the captain. Rest assured, 
we won't hold back. Fine. If it's a fight you want, you got it. Here we go. Oh, wow. You got a bunch of weirdos? Okay. Pretty balanced. You now have clerics. I'm going to assume that we want the trebuch. The trebuched. Uh, I'm going to try that. I'm going to try the trebuched. Assuming it's going to help. Let's put in Tifa also. Tifa and Barrett. Just let it rip. Range strike? What the hell? Uh... Oh, good. Gotta select fast. You mother. Sons of bitches. Uh, uh. Wow, dude, how the hell do you get close to him? How are you supposed to get close to him? Taking that guy out right about now. My god, what the hell? You're supposed to beat him. I don't get it. My God, holy moly. time he changes abilities seconds come on eight seconds guys come on let's go first try let's go let's go trebuchet trebuch it's the answer i knew it was I, i'm like we haven't used one where this is really good yet back where it belongs i just made i just assumed the trebuch was going to be good here Time's up. 
for this world and everyone in it god fort condor is yeah. so much fun but hey at least we can say we went out with a bang we sure did it was fun while it lasted thanks for playing with us friends may we meet again on the field of battle someday dude is fort condor going to continue past this well if we can find the time i wonder if there's more fort condor outside of this mission because there was an entire big mini game in an in intermission No way. Provided they accept the optional update, that is. Thanks to Chadley update, hard mode is now available in Fort Condor. Thanks, Chadley. Huh. Or that that was not hard? You telling me it gets harder? Next time we see him, I hope we're fighting on the same side. Wow. Yeah, you hang on to this. Just make sure to keep it safe, all right? Whatever the hell this thing is, I'm gonna put this right in my ass. What in the hell? Are all these four condors? Oh my god, we did everything. I didn't even mean to do everything, bro. I didn't even mean to do everything. I got this shit. Oops, played the game way too hard. I'm the Junon God. I got, we got Phoenix so early too. Back in Wutai. What the? An untethered soul. Adrift in the void of time. This bridge is make fast. Captain? Oh, dude. This guy's got to be a super boss or something like that. Does my judgment err? So it comes to this. What? Gilgamesh, you weirdo. Not today. They're just going to tease that, right? This guy's going to keep running away. Soldier boy here. A 
annoyance response triggered. Cause, there is a mocking tone of voice. Anyway, don't worry about it. Been in much worse situations than that before. Very well. Regardless, I will do what I can to improve security measures. So. Here's the crazy part. We did all this stuff here, but there's still more things to do. Like, we're not actually done in this area. Proto Relic Zero of Four? You're telling me there's more? Wait a minute. We got all the intel. The regional data is accumulated. Are you telling me that it says Proto Relic Zero of Four with a check mark? It's counting the hard mode for the Proto Relic? Oh dear. Yeah, dude, they're back. Every single one of these is back. Every single one of these is back. No way, man. I'll, I'll wait. I'll wait. They, they, those challenges are already hard enough, right? They are already ridiculously hard. Yeah, damn, Junon is awesome. Holy crap. Junon is friggin' hey, awesome. What were you thinking sending Sam back alone like that? He even need us in the first place? Your mother gives Stamp a run for his money. <laughs> That's right. So, how's my son? This dog. Seem okay? Yeah. You're gonna stand there and pretend this wasn't all about Claire and her bun in the oven? <laughs> Apple didn't fall far from this stubborn ass tree. That's for damn sure. <laughs> Wouldn't know about that. And if you're done making wisecracks, I got work to do. You did a good job today, boy. Someone's getting extra pets. Good puppy. That quest was great. Does she not know? That's the question. But maybe does she not know her, her her son's about to be a dad? Oh, I can talk to you. I did the thing. I'm back. Hey there. Thank you for tracking down that spot. Quite the view you captured. Good going. Association was impressed too. Bumped you up a rank. Your technique isn't exactly where it needs to be, but you've got promise, that's for sure. If you can develop your talents more, I guarantee you'll go places. The budding photographer. I wonder what that eventually leads to. Damn, did I want to play more Queen's Blood? Do you need something delivered? Damn. Cloud, you've completed our survey of the Junon region, I see. I've learned so much about the Republic of Junon, thanks in no small part to your efforts in these storied lands. Such insight into our past Whoa. will invariably help us understand the course Shinra may take in the future. I cannot thank you enough for partnering. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Develop the last of this materia. Um, combat sim. What do we got? What is the last rewards for the combat sim? Um, oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Do Cloud Barrett, uh, Tifa. Elemental materia. Huge. Moderately helpful. Oh, God. Hella annoying. Okay. With me. Let's go. You're mine. All set. Good to go. Copy. I dodged it. God damn, bro. Okay, hold on. One step. 
step at a time. Got him. Yeah, we got so many mid-air options. It's great. Yeah, I want this to be on PC so bad. Big boy. Deal with that. All right. Watch and learn. Stolen opportunity right here. Here it comes. Let's go. Oh, I got the collision. Oh. Uh, maximum fury. Damn, dude. No, oh, no, you stupid birds. You stupid birds. Oh god, three rares. Keep it together. Yes, it's my Up by these fucking birds. Give this bitch the avalanche two step. Okay. Earth's dead. Death from above is very bad. Weak against uh, wind. Okay. Let's push it. Let me handle this. Gotta be slow. <laughs> Nothing to it. Hang in there. Damn, bro. Go. Ready. Ha, come on. Bring it. Ha, I'm not going out like this. Do this right. God, man. Hey. I knew it. Goddamn cloud again. Jesus, fuck. Thank God, man. Thank God. 
Jesus, this bird was crazy. Is that it? We're fine. We're fine. Just can't revive anybody in here. No item usage. That was a challenging one, that's for sure. Just some lightning material. Grounded assholes. Give them hell. In need of my aid. Let's go red. The disparity between the crazy enemies, you know. I'm gonna use Gale on Tifa. I need to. I need to learn it. Three lizards. Round two of five. God. Cool. Red's so fun that you've already been using Tifa. Yeah, dude. Red is a lot of fun. These guys died quick. Flan. Any cool abilities in here? Electric impulse? Gonna make your eyeballs pop. Them off. Um, Sick. Oh boy. Defense and mad dash. Let's do mad dash. That works. Well, they're all dead. <laughs> well, they're all dead. Small wonder. They are daredevil. Finn Radash. Haversack. Shadow active. Asm the sun. Crust. Appreciate it, dude. There's that lightning materia. Um. Well, I got elemental now, dude. I actually got elemental. And we are clear on all this shit. 
I gather from your expression that you're eager for more. I look forward to seeing what new discoveries you make in your travels. Shut up, Chadley. Shut up, you. Um... Okay. And if I go to... Tier and Equipment, Clink. Oh god, Cloud. Oh, oh god, we have... Oh god. Oh god. Weapon leveled up. Attack power plus F and 20, brother. ATB charge rate up. Attack power plus 20. Good God. I can stick luck up on here. Oh God, red. Uh, What should I give you? Can't have elemental or warding. Fortunately, you take HP up. It's just the way it be. Aerith. Barrett also got another spot. Damn, dude, linked materia slots are becoming a problem. <sighs> another HP up. Synergy damage up. Max HP plus 200. Unflinching overcharge. You know what? I kind of like that. I kind of like that. Oh, hell yeah. 5% basic attack. Activates concentration after being revived. No, let's go for attack damage. What else can we do? We have uh, lightning, ice. Man. None of my weapons have the ability to do element... Wait. Barrett's does. God, man. I need some linked slots already. Jesus. Maybe I can actually craft it. One a second. I can. I can. I can craft it. I can upgrade it as well. Tyrion equipment. Uh, bear it. Here. Dog. Let's put this on you. Yeah, I'll take it. And I do this. Uh, swap. Swap. Uh, swap. And Barrett is get. I guess Barrett's gonna get elemental. Right? Barrett's just gonna get elemental. I want to start leveling it up. That's 8% linked elemental damage. Cool. You know? Cool. I'm down with that. Is this autocast maxed up? It is. Did I literally level up all of my autocasts? Nearly. Oh, yay, yay, yay. Damn, materia combinations. Chakra is almost maxed out. ATB Stagger's about to level up. Dude, I'm getting close to getting... No, I'm not getting close to getting Thundaga. Um, Tifa. I need to go buy, like, another HP+. plus. How is Cloud once again turning into Purple Man? This dude's literally turning into Purple Man again. Every single time. I don't get it. Purple Man. Should be up. Okay, who else can we mess around with? Red 13. Restores HP when activating Vengeance Mode? I'll take it. Damn. Getting kind of stacked now, dude. So Tifa still needs to use Reverse Gale a whole bunch, and Aerith also needs to use her crazy thing so that we can earn those... Uh, upgrade weapons? Yeah. So what is this looking like? I got some Fulios in here too. Next upcoming level, ATB recharge rate. 
10%. Links another Materia slot. Thank God. Max MP by 3, attack by 13, increase magic attack by 13. Buster Swords linkage, link slottage ain't looking so good. Um, okay. Increases HP recovery by 20% when healing. Magic attack damage, linking a slot. All right, so these are all very good. We should probably go upgrade Fulio stuff. I'll stay at the end. Welcome. Need some rooms? Okay. I wonder if you get eight SP it. from all fights. I wonder. I wonder if you do. Um. Julio's are. Where? It's the weapons guy. And my god of books. A god of books. All right. Let's see if we get some cool things. And man, am I tired. Holy hell, I'm feeling it, dude. Sitting in this chair for too long. Weapon skill unlock. Uh. A melee blade. I'll take it. Uh, I might have to start customizing those things. I might have too many on cloud. I'm gonna do this. Overall attack increase. I'm gonna do this. I think cloud already has a lot of stuff that I can do. HP by 200 for red 13. Uh, do we have another sync ability? Yeah, I'll do iron defense. That's fun. A big parry. Red 13 almost has too many abilities, right? Almost has too many. Earth. Tempest damage. about that? Enduring Ward, huh? I'll take this for five, yeah. Okay. Damage increase. What'd you get, Barrett? Flies the protect status up effect upon entering battle? What? Huh? How can I not say no to that? Auto barrier on Barrett. Oh, that's good. That overcharge thing is really good. Look at this though. Tifa! Uh, I got 10. HP plus 200 ain't bad. And you know what? I'll do this. Just to have it. Refocus is cool. Come back soon! Well, these characters are getting shit. Let's go see what the heck's going on with this freaking frog. These stairs? Do. What in the hell is going on with this freaking frog? Another day in a Lately, I've been. This game's got me streaming way too much, dude. Ribbit. Oh. Uh, hello. Hey, what do you think you're doing 
here. This is a no grown up zone. Get lost. You're a kid? Well, duh. It's just how this place is. I don't know if it's because of the reactor out there or what, but hanging out here turns you into a frog. Hey, Finn. Wow. Not Shinra, I hope. Oh, no, we're definitely not. Oh, wait. You must be the ones Priscilla was talking about. She told me how you saved her. Right, that's us. We're friends. Are you a friend of hers, too? We're friends, but it's not like I like her or anything. It's just there aren't a lot of other kids in the village, so I basically had to be your friend. <laughs> of course. So what are you kids doing all the way down here? Uh, playing Jump Frog, obviously. Actually, we could use a couple more players. Since you're here, do you want to give it a try? What? Ah! Help us! <clears throat> Come on, Cloud. Ribbit? Tifa. I tried to warn you. Like I said, hanging out here turns you into a frog. But don't worry. All you gotta do is start thinking like a frog. And you'll be fine. Ribbit. 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 Aerith is a frog. Puzzle frogged out. Frog stagger. I missed, bro. There's like some crazy tech that the frogs have, right? This is cr what the hell is going on? Report back to the children. Will do. Incoming obstacles and dash to safety with R2 or L3. Remain on the platform as long as you can. Think you two can handle it? What in the hell? What in the hell is this game? Frog guys? Fusion Frenzy! Oh my god. Okay. Wow, it is fall, guys. I don't believe this shit, man. Stay on the inside. That's the only way. You fools. 30 minutes. This is going to be easy. God. Okay. Okay, I'm trying to understand the challenge. Oh god, frog guys. No! Damn, I got obliterated. I got sent into space. Pretty fun, right? All right. Eh, I've played worse. Anyway, thanks again for your help. I gotta. You can come back again if you want. I gotta try it again. You I look get... like you were having fun. You rip it. <laughs> I could get used to it. Yeah, I wouldn't go that far. Ribbit, ribbit. Hey! Ribbit. Ribbit, ribbit, ribbit. <laughs>
The relationship with Tifa has deepened. Your relationship with Tifa has deepened. Ribbit. Uh, I want more enfeeblement rings. 55, 55 seconds, no problem. Here we go. Yeah, Barrett's a bigger frog than everybody. Same with all these people. Aerith has a big old bow tie on her head. You fools. Gotta try to outrun this thing, man. Dude, I have to make this jump or some shit? Son of a bitch! Okay. Jesus. What? Let me look at this ring. Ribbit, ribbit. 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 Well, that's something. Come on, guys, get out of there. They hang out, so they hang behind so hard. Um, what does the enfeeblement thing do? Uh... Grants Toad at the start of the battle? I... Alright. Frog only run? Only frogs? Can you guys subscribe to my only frogs? Can you? Um, I want to see the grasslands really quick. Right? Is it's like a different time of day right now? Oh, I can't. I just realized I got to go back to the Junon region and I have to go here. Yeah. No free access. The weapon shop in Junon just has all the same stuff I already have. So I think we're caught up on the necessary equipment. I think so. So, need a lift somewhere? I just want to go see if the grasslands looks any different because of the time of day. Or it's the same time of day we were at before, I don't know. Yeah, no, we're at the same time of day again. The non, so it's like regular daytime and sunset. So the grasslands is back to being normal. Back to being totally normal.
Excuse me, chicken. We got the story moving slightly. Hey, we did. We went to Junon. We did. Dude. The next time we play, there will be a lot of story. Because... What? Next time there'll be a lot of story because it's Junon upper level and then also the boat. And then also potentially Costa del Sol. Why, if it ain't my favorite customers. So, how are the birds treating you? Good. Big bird, very good. My bird has a hat. My bird has a hat. My chicken has a hat. Well, this game's something else, man. Right? This game is something else. If I go down to the marsh, is it still... Is it all messed up? Still? This game's really something else. Yeah. Marsh gets all foggy, no matter what. Marsh will be dank. Ain't no way around it. Oh, man. All right. All right. All right, all right, all right. We've done everything, dude. We literally did everything unintentionally. Swear to God. I didn't even mean to do all this stuff. Which is crazy. Just crazy. It's so good. We're going to do some... Mad MSQ tomorrow. I'll probably be back on my typical uh, stream time a bit later. We got a birthday party for a friend that we're going to be hanging out with. But, you know, we'll be back. Oh, man, I'll be back. I'm going to go to... Um, here. So good. So good. My god, dude. Spare your legs and catch your eye. So much effort was put into this game. There was just an absolute metric ton of hard work and effort put into this shit. It's crazy, man. So much friggin' effort. I can't believe how good Junon was. I can't believe it. It was so sick. It was so sick. This entire zone was so cool. Kind of blowing my mind how cool it was. My favorite minigame so far? Uh, Queen's Blood. 100%. Queen's Blood was absolutely my favorite minigame. It is my favorite minigame, and it still is. It's ridiculously addictive. It's better than Triple Triad, in my opinion. It's not as simple as Triple Triad is, but that's what makes it fun. Oh no, this year's colors cannot be edited. Dang it. I can't edit the colors here. Um, to be real, Fort Condor is great, but it's hard in this game, man. It's hard because the enemies take advantage of the systems in ways that you can't. Because they get 
they get characters that blitzkrieg through which is funny because that's what you do to the AI to break it in the Yuffie DLC. You just have one that blitzes, blitzes through. So it makes, it makes it super hard because now the enemy does that shit to you and it's like, ugh. Ugh. God, man. Yeah, we had a four Condor fight. It took us like four tries. Uh, what character do I find to be the most fun? Cloud. Cloud is Devil May Cry air combos, the character, and I'm 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 here for it. He's ridiculously cool. I can't believe it. He's so much fun. They went ham on Cloud's gameplay. Like absolutely disgustingly ham. He's so much fun to play now. He's pretty straightforward and kind of boring in remake compared to this shit, dude. So they made him air combos the character. Such a good call. It was such a good call. I wish I could stop doing the side shit and actually play the game, but the side content is so good. I can't believe it. Yeah, it's it's crazy how good the side the side content is like MSQ shit in other games that would be like this. Side content is, and, and the MSQ shit is huge set pieces and stuff. It's crazy. It's crazy how high quality it is. Yo, Desilience, thank you. I haven't found one side quest that I was like, I could have, I could have skipped that. There hasn't been a single side quest that is like, yeah, okay, no, we, we would have been fine avoiding this. Don't need to do that. feels like we've been on a legit big-ass adventure because of it. Or we've met, like, a ton of people and have done all this shit. Feels like we're actually adventuring. <laughs> 